Actually, oh, okay, yeah, actually, down. nice. All right, let, let's let's get in this car here. Let's go. Yeah. So what's what's different about some hybrid vehicles is that you have to actually um, put your foot on the brake to engage the yeah. regenerative brake, and whenever you're letting off the accelerator in the it, it mimics the engine drag. It's what it's doing. Exactly. It's mimicking. You can control it here. Um, oh, you know, wow. I, was, I was talking about all the controls that you can you can adjust. So we can adjust how high the ride height of the vehicle is. Um, we can change the steering, which I, I recommended on Sport. But if you wanted to, like, for instance, wiggle the wheel now. See how it's pretty heavy? Yeah. Now fill it. Yeah. Isn't well, that that's crazy? bizarre. And, and that's what I tell my salespeople. It's like, hey, we certainly want to emphasize the, the fundamental difference that Model S has, uh, you know, to any other car. However, you don't want people to think that it's so alien that it's not something that they can own. You know, right. It's not a spaceship. Right. <laughs> Although he would design them. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he does design rockets, so, yeah, but I wouldn't compare this to the Falcon 9, you know, in a lot of ways other than just it's, it's very innovative for its space. You know, from here, you can delineate how open you want the roof. <laughs> Opens quite a bit, all the way to. Wow. So this kind of gives the the open air driving experience, something you know, similar to a Target top or, or even a convertible. Okay. Showrooms right on the corner of K there. America. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Built in California. <laughs> so we'll take it right at the next light. You can probably get some good acceleration here. I want to make the capital come to us quite quickly. Okay. Try to not to hit any uh, pedestrians while we're at it. Oh my gosh. Right. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's got a lot of kick to it. So a whole lot of low-end <laughs> torque. Um, you know, that's the advantage of having an electric motor is that you have instant access. And, and the one-speed gearbox um, doesn't offer any, any interruption like a normal internal combustion engine would have as you switch gears. I have never felt that before in my life, except on a roller coaster ride, I think. Super smooth, very quiet. Um, the active air suspension is very receptive to the terrain that you're driving on. So in a lot of our test drives over the summer, we were trying to find places in the test drive route where you'd actually go over some train tracks or some yeah. potholes to show how well the car receives in the road beneath it. Yeah, we, I've had folks that have come in, we just started test driving on a regular basis here in DC. Uh, folks that are used to driving Panamera Turbos, M-Series from BMW and AMGs from Mercedes and get in this car and realize that they can find the same performance, yeah. um, the same luxury. It's really quite cool, especially it's from awesome. a company you know, that started in California that's building cars here. I think that's very impressive. My, my father was in manufacturing back in the day and um, to see a lot of his craft go overseas, um, I think it's inspiring, especially kind of where our economy and national security is to have you know, major manufacturing here in the states. And Let's yeah, do it. yeah, keep rolling. That's zero. Holy two, cow! That right? one, that seems that faster 66. than sixty-six. That seemed faster <laughs> than four seconds. <laughs> yeah, it goes quick. You heard a bit of the whine of the AC induction motor. I mean, it's. it's I love that whine. <laughs> That's the Tesla that, smile. We're that is about. the the laugh, the Tesla laugh. 